Здраво, здраво. Како секогаш така и овој пат, каде како не во музичката емисија Македонска Харт and Heavy. Овој пат се наоѓаме на местото на злосторството. По крај мене имаме нови согорници, ни доаѓаат од Соединетите Американски држави. Значи станува за збор за бен кој е, негува Dead Trash Metal. Станува збор за Battle Cross. First you welcome to TV show Heart and Heavy Macedonian TV show. All right. Yeah. Tell me, your band exists in 2003, but your first uh, demo in 2005. Uh, after you uh, be the uh, first album, I think so, in 2010, uh, Push and... Uh, push and uh, Destroy, yeah. yeah. They, well, they started... Uh... Yeah, we started the band back in uh, 2003, and uh, roughly around that time. We went through different lineup changes, sound changes, and all that stuff. 2007 was kind of like the birth of this band. And, um, you know, uh, Don joined in 2008, and uh, Gummy joined about 2011, 2010, 2010. So, and then, um, so we had did Pushable Destroy, it was a self-release, and then when uh, Gumby joined, uh, basically, we got signed to Metal Blade, and we basically re-recorded the vocals for um, uh, Pushable Destroy, which became Pursuit of Honor. It was remixed and mastered. And so. I just changed Aiden to Caleb. That was it. <laughs> I changed it from the old guy's son to my son. That's, you, that's the only difference. You the last uh, album, it's 2050. Yeah. Tell me, where do you recording? Uh, tell me, uh, maybe you have not the new material because the one year the be before. Um, so the last studio we went to, we did uh, at Audio Hammer Studios. Mm -hmm. And we did that for um, the last two records, War of Will and Rise to Power. Um, and we worked with... Uh, Jason Sukoff and Mark Lewis on the last record, and uh, we had that Audio Hammer's down in Florida, and that's where we went and recorded the album, and uh, it was an awesome experience. I mean, you know, just working with Jason and all that. Very easy, very easy to work with. It was about as smooth as you can go. Just very nice and smooth. That's about all I can say. We were in no rush, no rush. Didn't feel pressured at all. Just got up, woke up. You ready to you ready to track some bass? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. play. You have very interesting uh, lyrics. You have uh, lyrics from the history, and you have uh, for for the positive uh, yeah. ideas. Where well, take it inspiration? Who write the lyrics? Uh, I, I wrote. I write a lot of the lyrics. Uh, me and Jason on the last one, we wrote a lot of them. Uh, Don will come through, and he'll. I'll pass my lyrics on to him. I'm like, hey, how does, does, do I sound a little bit stupid when I say stuff like this? But uh, I just like to keep things positive. You know, there's a, there's a lot of negativity in the world and there's a lot of, you know, just stuff that people don't believe in, you know? I, I just believe in yourself, you know? You gotta, if you don't, you, you know, it's easy to, you know, just get lost and get depressed. And I don't, I don't like to be depressed and it's just, you know, music is your outlet to feel better, I think. You know, it's how I've got through a lot of my, you know, your childhood, you know, you feel down, but then you listen to some music and you just, you get out of it. You can either escape into it or you can imagine that for that one second you're actually killing that person that you really want to kill, but you don't actually kill them, so you don't go to jail. So that's, yeah. that's really good. So, I mean, it's just music should be your escape into anything. So it's good to have, you know, I do have some songs that aren't really positive, but they're, they're few and far between. Um, but, you know, you just got to purge yourself of those shitty thoughts and try to be a better person. I like it, your lyrics, because I'm a poet. I like the lyrics and oh, I have a band and the same similar uh, awesome. Social tax, uh, positive ideas, yeah. the same. Because the many band of the death metal, trash, the depressive uh, lyrics, uh, yeah, anti-religions and uh, <laughs> apocalypse. Uh, yeah, I, uh, suicide's not cool. Yeah. <laughs> and your first time here in uh, uh, Europe? Uh, no, this is our third time here. Third time. But yep. your first time here in uh, Actually, Balkan. Second time second. in uh, Slovenia. Second time, yeah. But, but we only played to like three people. <laughs> uh, so, uh, yeah. Ljubljana? Ljubljana. Yeah. Ah, in Ljubljana. The yeah. Mm -hmm. In the be the tour, uh, your tour? Uh? Yeah, with us and Huntress. We played at, well, us and Huntress when we were on our festival run two years ago. And there wasn't too many people there. 
So it, it's okay if you don't you don't know about it because nobody really did. <laughs> you playing the more in the uh, festivals on earlier? Yeah. yeah, we played more festivals. We did some stuff with Ho Toxic Holocaust, but mostly we just came over here for the fests. Um, festivals are cool. Uh, we did Resurrection Fest and we did Metal Days or. This is metal, rock marathon. Mm -hmm. So it's, and uh, actually we, because we were on rock marathon, um, we met up with uh, Testament. And Testament were like, hey, what are you guys doing? We're like, we're pretty much just vacationing here. And they were like, you want to hop on a show? We're like, no, we totally don't want to come on a show with Testament. So they actually let us come on to a show, and that was really cool. So we enjoyed that. Yeah. So that was fun. Do you have a video clips promotion for your bands and oh, we have a few music videos, yeah, definitely. We got one for uh Push Pull Destroy, um Absence. That's our newest one, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah newest absence. one is Absence off of Rise to Power. We've also done one for uh we have a is it a lyric video for Caleb? No, we have no, a real video. A, we, yeah. we have a real video? Oh that's right, with the cuts. I remember that, yeah. Um, we have a few lyric videos, a couple playthrough videos. We have plenty of promotion. Yep, find it on YouTube. Mm -hmm. Search Battlecross, you'll find all that stuff yeah. on there. Yeah. Seeing the YouTube Battlecross. And who are the plan in the future in the Battlecross? Uh, you know, more touring and then um, probably just start getting to writing, you know, yeah. the, the other yeah, album. So. Yeah. <laughs> not trying not to go too broke, yeah. but, uh, you know. No, I mean, you know, honestly, we're just going to be um, doing some more touring and then write, and then work on writing another album. So, uh, yeah. Certainly the focus is going to be on album four. It's, yeah. it's time to start writing. Cause the last two albums, we didn't really give ourselves enough time to write. Yeah. This time, we're going to get a nice head start yeah. and really flesh this one out so it doesn't... Because the albums sound good, but to us, as the musicians on them, they feel kind of rushed. Yeah. We, we kind of hear them like... Maybe we could have done something different on this part, but this time we're really gonna be thoughtful about it. Yeah, yeah. we've always kind of been like went straight from tour to write an album. Yeah, and well, take it the name Battle Cross of Bang. Where'd where it come from? Yeah, it's, where it come it's from. sort of something that uh, Tony thought up of, and uh, really we just try to keep it open to whoever however people want to perceive it, but it, honestly, it was just sort of so, a name that sounded really cool to us, <laughs> no and, and no one else had the band name. We, we searched it, and we're like, hey, nobody has this name. It sounds cool, and it just stuck with us, and, uh, you know, it's just something that overall, to me, just when I think of that word, it's just something that's just powerful and heavy, and just, I don't know, I just hear that name to me, and, you know, it's just something that we wanted to have that just sort of like, you know it's metal. You know it's a metal band. And uh, how you, you know, whether you think it's power metal or thrash metal, whatever, you know, I think people have different perception when they, before they hear the music. But uh, we just wanted something that just sounded strong, and uh, I think that kind of comes across, so. Mm -hmm. You're a mix, just like a thrash and that. Uh, yeah, uh. it's a beautiful, beautiful medley, I'd say. Um, and we, actually, when we were playing with Toxic Holocaust, I was like, man, we're not really that thrash. Because <laughs> when, you, when you hear a real, like, just thrash band, you're just like, Shit, we're not really that thrash, but you know we're you know Testament's a big influence, uh, yeah. Pantera, Metallica, just you like it old school. Uh, yeah, and, and you got to throw some Cannibal in there. Yeah. but uh, it's just a, it's it's a good mixture, and I you know uh, my voice you can go in between the, the thrash and death a little bit, but I mean I'm more of a death metal growler I think, but not too much of the. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> but um, no, we 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 do like to keep it in the, in between. And there's some some more, some songs that go way more to the death metal side, and then there's some songs that tend more to the melodic side and thrashier. So it's just you got to keep people in, in today's world. You got to keep people interested. You know, you can't just be like, here's a song and here's another song. You gotta you gotta have everything, or else people are just gonna stop. Mm -hmm. Ups and downs, you know what I mean, and it's sort of like a a roller coaster listening to the song, you know, have parts that groove, have parts that just hit hard or fast, you know, and, and we just try not to limit ourselves to how we're going to write. We're not going to say, oh, well, since we play, you know, sort of thrash style, we're only going to write that style. We just try to mix everything that we're all influenced by and put that together and then, you know, in a, in a constructive sort of uh, controlled way, in a sense, you know, so it's not just a bunch of chaos of mixing styles. We sort of try to take it and blend it together well. You know, that's what we try to go for. Yeah. 
And for the end, what do you like it to say for Macedonian metal fans? Uh, Thanks for being metal. Yeah. yeah. Keep your ears open. If you, if you hear us come to town, come check us out. We won't disappoint you. Yeah.